New at 5, the gunshot detection technology Shot Spotter is coming to Tacoma. The police department announced thanks to grant funding, they will test that equipment out. Tacoma's Paul Rivera is live in Tacoma tonight at the Star Center where a presentation wrapped up this afternoon, including a discussion about Shot Spotter. Paul, what are you hearing there? Do people think this will work? Well, I talked to a community member inside there who believes this could help lower the amount of gunfire that's happening in Tacoma. As for the police chief, he says, we'll see. At a workshop in Tacoma, Sound Thinking, the company behind ShotSpotter, gave a brief presentation. The technology detects gunfire where it happened, and that info was sent to police officers who can then go to the area. Why do you feel like Tacoma needs something like this? Good question. Here's why, a lot of gunshot fire that people hear and report. So the idea is to use this equipment as a tool to help us from an investigative perspective. Tacoma is in the middle of a plan to reduce crime. Police Chief Avery Moore believes the technology can help, but critics claim the detection doesn't work well. Some of the controversy behind it is that this might have police officers chasing basically nothing. The data will speak for itself. Again, this is why this is a pilot. Um, I don't read stuff that other people say. I like to read my own book, if you will. A company rep also addressed privacy concerns and the criticism of ShotSpotter. We're in over 170 cities, and we have a retention rate of 99%. Alfred Lewis Jr. was also in Seattle two months ago to speak about the product. I can tell you that um, an accuracy of 90% of when gunfire is occurring within a coverage area is a lot better than the less than 20% that the police get when people call in. While gunfire calls were down last year versus 2022, it was still at nearly 3,000 calls. I think that is an amazing technology. Whitney Wilkins works for Sage Investment Group. The company opened up new apartments in place of dilapidated buildings to try and make South Hosmer safer. She thinks ShotSpotter could work. I think technology can only help us in this effort, especially if we can res respond to things a lot more quicker and, and assist our police department. So where are these sensors going to go in Tacoma and how soon will the city be able to figure out if this works or it doesn't work in the city? The police chief told me the location is still being worked out, but the test program could last a year before they figure that out. The company rep told me, though, that they will be having more community meetings in Tacoma about the product. Reporting in Tacoma, Paul Rivera, Como News.